when you're holding a note, uh, you need to have images. Because, and the, the example I give for this is when my friend was um, uh, doing Wicked. Wizard and I is like, it's like the killer song for everybody because it's like, so, you have so much energy coming out of Alphaba and then it's like, I have this terrifying song to sing five seconds later. It's just, it's such a scary song to do. It's like, you know, it'd be much easier to begin with, you know, I'm not that girl. But it begins with like the crazy, the wizard. And it's just like, everyone's at the nervous right. So anyway, she was doing Elphaba and she was freaking out over that last C because it's like right in everybody's kind of break that C. It's like right in the middle of people's breaks. So the whole wizard and I, and it's just all the pressure was like, I've got to be a belter. The point is, I was just like cut on concentrating on the note. Like once you sort of develop, let's say your technique on how you're going to hit it, like you have to at some point kind of figure out how you're going to hit it, whether you're going to mix it or belt it. But once you're past that, whenever you're holding a note, you have to have images. Because in real life, you don't go like, the wizard and ah, like you wouldn't like literally say the word for an hour and a half. So the holding the note is sort of replicating either dialogue you'd be having or just like an internal fantasy. In other words, when I told her for let's say holding that note, instead of like, Focusing on like, how do I sound? Oh my God, I'm running out of air. Where's my vibrato? I'm awful, I'm gonna be fired. Like instead of all those things going through your head, which go through people's heads also at auditions, just have like three distinct images. So for that song specifically, let's say I told her like, the wizard and I, like imagine like you're gonna meet the wizard, he's gonna take away your green, you're both gonna rule the kingdom. So instead of just like horrible thoughts going through her head, it was like the wizard and I, like I'm gonna meet him, he's gonna take away my green, I'm gonna rule the kingdom, bum. And those images take you out of the obsession about the technique and whether the audience knows specifically what you're thinking or not, it doesn't matter because the audience is like, something's going on, how interesting. Like they're watching your face and they're not just like watching you be like, ah, you know, like obsessing about your note. So that's something I'm gonna bring up with you guys a lot is when you're holding a note, you have to have like specific images. Um,